This video is supported by DIY Guru, the maker's learning platform. Hyderabad based retrofitting startup eTrio becomes India's first company to have EV retrofitting certificates from ARAI and ICATS for sedans and LCVs. eTrio has appointed Bharat Mobi as its B2C channel partner and working towards the certification for 15 more categories of vehicles. Noida Authority has produced 5 Tata Tigers on rental basis from Energy Efficiency Services Limited (EESL) under the Union Ministry of Power. The 5 EVs has been procured on lease for a period of 6 years. Each vehicle has an estimated running charge of Rs 22,500 along with GST per month. Berling India is ready to launch its high-speed electric scooter Aura in December. The scooter recently got approval from iCAT. Coming to the scooter specifications, Berling Aura works with 1200 watt BLDC motor and powered by lithium iron phosphate battery which gives a range of 120 km on a single charge. And the top speed of this scooter is 60 km. The expected price of this scooter is 90,000 rupees. One of the leading three-wheeler manufacturer in India, Atul Auto, is planning to launch its first ever lithium-ion battery-powered electric three-wheeler in 2020. The company's current e-vehicles, e-light passenger and e-light cargo are powered by lead-acid batteries. The famous lead-acid battery manufacturer, Exide, has launched its first electric rickshaw, which is powered by lead-acid battery pack with a price of 1.2 lakhs. However, Exide to enter into lithium-ion battery manufacturing by end of December at its Gujarat facility. Go green, go electric.